What's up guys, it's Taja here and welcome back to another Last of Us Part 2 informational video. And before we get into today's news, if you guys could go ahead and smash the like button for me, I really appreciate that. Let's shoot for 250 likes today. Yes, 250 as well as subscribe to the channel if you are new. I upload daily Last of Us Part 2 quality content. You guys will really appreciate the content that I post. And without further ado, let's get right into the video. So if you're a fan of the channel, you guys already know that I will be live streaming Gamescom tomorrow. And, you know, we're going to just all party up, just talking, you know, just try to see if we're going to get anything about The Last of Us Part 2. And then we could all, you know, just react to it together. And as I've been preaching already multiple times is that I honestly think a trailer will be here during PSX. That's what I'm really hoping for. But lately, you guys have actually been getting me kind of amped up for Gamescom. And, you know, I feel like there's a plausible reason we can get The Last of Us Part 2 during Gamescom. Now, I will say, I think The Last of Us Part 2 will be a surprise appearance, mainly because PlayStation actually came out and confirmed everything that they're going to show in their conference. And before we go on, actually, guys, let me actually correct what I just said before. PlayStation will actually not have a conference at Gamescom. Think of it more as like a presentation. They're going to go in and they're just going to show straight gameplays and demos and trailers. You know, just get right to the point. Just get right to the juicy stuff. Gamescom, usually they don't have conferences. They just usually get right to the point and just show the games and that's it all about the games so yes playstation's having a presentation if we're supposed to be speaking politically correct here so according to this games rant article that i will be leaving in the description below the confirmed first party titles for the playstation presentation consist of dreams medieval concrete genie and ready set heroes now for third party titles that these are also confirmed like these are first sure going to be in the presentation our final fantasy 7 remake call of duty modern warfare control which i'm actually really excited for and grand blue fantasy versus now you may be wondering tajay bro like I didn't hear The Last of Us in there. Now, let me actually tell you why The Last of Us 2 could still possibly show up. So, honestly, like I said before, I think it's going to be a surprise. It will be, like, the biggest thing ever, like, the biggest shebang. Kind of like how State of Play, they actually surprised us and showed off Final Fantasy VII. Not that this pretty much really validates that we can get Last of Us Part Two, but... The first Last of Us was actually shown off at Gamescom 2012, so I mean, you guys know how I feel about reoccurring events in history. I feel like if it's happened once, it could definitely happen again. Now, for those of you who actually don't think there's no chance at all that we can get a Last of Us Part 2 trailer during Gamescom, a recent leak actually says otherwise. The article from Twisted Voxel states, The Last of Us Part 2 still doesn't have a release date despite multiple rumors, but that is going to change soon. Sony could possibly announce a new release date for the game at Gamescom. Naughty Dog is currently hard at work on The Last of Us Part 2, which is one of the last remaining PS4 exclusives releasing ahead of the PS5. One such exclusive was Death Stranding, which has received a release date before E3 2019. It is set to arrive this year, leaving a question mark behind The Last of Us Part 2, which is one of the most anticipated PS4 exclusives. There has been a lot of rumors regarding The Last of Us Part 2. One such rumor placed the release of the game in the first half of 2020, which means it could arrive before July 31st, 2019. Now, before we actually exactly continue reading this, I think they actually meant to say 2020. So yes, instead of 2019, just you know, fill in with your head 2020. Others have been more specific placing it in February and sharing details on the different additions that will launch with the game. Ashley Johnson, who voices Ellie, has also made a little hint at it in one of her interviews, leading people to believe it will possibly arrive in February. This brings us to Gamescom 2019. Sony is one of the 16 major companies to share a new announcement at Gamescom. According to the source of this new rumor, Sony had planned a release date announcement and trailer for The Last of Us Part 2, but the announcement was delayed. It was supposed to already happen by now along with Death Stranding, but got delayed for unknown reasons. Of course, we have to take this rumor with a grain of salt. If we do believe this rumor, then the trailer should drop soon, and Gamescom appears to be the right time for it. Since the trailer confirming the release date will go public before October, if we don't get it at Gamescom, then it might be announced at Tokyo Game Show 2019, which is in September. Okay guys, so this is actually a lot for me to take in here. Now, for this leak, I'm actually tell you guys that I actually think this is credible. Now, I'm going to give you guys the reasons why I actually believe in this. So, they made a statement that we should have already had a reveal for the game as long as the release date. And I feel like that's true because it does line up with Jason Schreier saying that the game would be coming out 2019. As well as that lines up with um, Gustavo Santalaja, the musician of the game, saying the game is coming soon. Which was also soon would be, you know, later down in 2019 as well. Which means, if they were to have shown off this game earlier this year, 
the only time frame that this game would make sense to come out would be late 2019 but as you know the game was internally pushed back not really globally since you know there wasn't a release date but it was internally pushed back and now we're actually you know still sitting here without a lick of information for the game to be shown off what also gets me to believe that this is actually true is because they don't state, you know, that the game will be shown off, you know, in September for Outbreak Day. Because they do state that the game should be shown off before October. And the second date they actually give that if it's not supposed to be shown during Gamescom 2019, that it could be shown during another event, which is called Tokyo's Games Week. Now, I feel like that would be a great time since, you know, that is another event. And if PlayStation does show up for that, because I know they, I know JRPGs is a thing. And that would be their main priority if they were to show up to something like that. But I feel like them sneaking in The Last of Us Part 2 could be, you know, Know, pr pretty good so honestly yes the last of us part two could be shown during that time but really this leak it has me really feeling really good about gamescom tomorrow gamescom is literally tomorrow guys literally and it's a very big event and all these other games are going to be there all these other publishers are going to be there so i feel like this is the perfect time to sneak in a demo it's literally a presentation of just full-blown game demos we don't know who's going to be over at, to at tokyo's games week next next month like sony might show up but this is the best time to show off like the, you know come on pop out we haven't seen anything about this game in a very long time it's been over a year and honestly we don't even know what the comp type of competition is going to even be at tokyo's games week or how big tokyo's game week will actually even be so honestly i'm leaning more on the game showing up during gamescom and if it doesn't show up gamescom honestly i'm gonna just have to say this um leak is baloney and just go back to wait until psx that's really exactly how i'm feeling right now now, if you guys are actually also wondering what could be inside the games trailer or what could they show off over at Gamescom, if you actually go check out yesterday's video, I actually gave five different topics of why. So I will leave that in the cards right here. So we're not going to be talking about that this video, but you could definitely backtrack really fast and just go look at that video. It's a lot. It's very informational, very good stuff in there. So yes, if you need an idea of what, you know, you know, some things that we would like to see in the Gamescom trailer, definitely check that video out. But yeah, guys, as I said before, this game is just looking better and better and better by the second and i really do feel like we could probably get some during gamescom and i'm actually very excited so i need everybody to show up tomorrow at 12 30 okay i'm gonna start the stream at 12 30 central time because the, the the conference or the event actually starts at one o'clock central time and we're just gonna all you know sit back and chillax and just watch and we're gonna see if the last of us 2 makes an appearance and that's in, in any type of form like any form at all we need to see this game like i do not care what i have to do to see the last of us part two but i swear to god you already know i'm gonna take this gun i'm gonna shoot <laughs> no i'm just kidding but do you guys think this is actually credible like i would love to know your guys opinions this is really just i don't know for me it looks better at first as i said as i said man psx 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 i'm keep saying that put most of your faith into psx but gamescom has just been slowly slowly looking more appealing as of lately and i think you know it's you know pretty plausible so in the comments down below if you guys could actually let me know what you're excited for about this game okay tell me what you're excited most excited for about this game let me know what you think about this game coming at gamescom do you think this leak is plausible yes or no as well as if we do see this game at gamescom in what form how would you like to see this game be portrayed or shown up at gamescom okay leave those things down inside the comments below let's go ahead and take that w and have that big discussion and then i'm gonna say this one last time just as one last reminder guys gamescom starts on the 19th which is tomorrow monday okay monday on monday we will be seeing playstation's presentation okay we will be seeing playstation's presentation and it's going to have all those games that i listed off before as well as hopefully the last of us part two so make sure you guys show up to my stream i will be streaming it we all need to come together so i need everybody who views this video all my supporters all my subs even if you're not go ahead and drop a sub and we all need to come and show out and we just need all the best vibes possible that we can get to see the last of us part two also as another reminder make sure that you guys take this loop with a grain of salt it's not 100 so we really don't know if we're gonna see something 100 at gamescom but it's just you know just to have something to look forward to because we really haven't had anything to truly look forward to for this game in a very long time so i feel like we just stay optimistic and on our toes you never know we might be you know very well impressed and surprised about what we may get to see so if you guys could leave a like on this video as i said before let's shoot for 250 likes i really appreciate that as well as subscribe to the channel if you are new and with the post notifications on so you guys do not miss out on this stream tomorrow and as always that is little Taj signing out and i'll see you guys tomorrow with another banger